On today's spooky review spot, we're going to be having a look at Crush Ghoulish Grape. Ghoulish Grape. I actually picked this up at Walmart. Um, I was acquiring a, a couple of purchases while I was there, and uh, I happened to come across this. And I thought, well, I'm a big fan of grape, of grape pop, I'm a big fan of Crush, and I'm a big fan of ghouls, so hey, why not pick this baby up? Um, not really going to be much of a review. I mean, uh, I don't really think I have to tell you too much about the bottle, but uh, I got I, I like the little, uh, I like the little ghoul face on there with the squinty eyes. You can see like the little hand reaching out. Now I don't know if this is just a marketing ploy from the good folks at Crush. I don't know if maybe this is just grape soda and then they've just slapped on ghoulish grape or if it's a different flavor. I'm leaning towards different flavor guys. I'm hope hopefully it's not going to be disappointing. But I figured I'd do a review of it, seeing as we're into the month of the Rabu Spot reviews. So let's get this bad boy open up and I'll tell you what I think of it. Ah uh, nothing. Nothing more rewarding than the opening up a bottle of pop and you hear that pssssss. Woo! I know we don't have smell-o-vision here, but if you could smell that, boy, that's a strong smelling grape. So uh, what we'll do is we'll have a drink here, a little swig, if you will. Hmm. Well, seems like it. There is nothing different between this and regular grape. So, yeah. So it would seem the scariest part of this ghoulish grape is the fact that if you're looking for it to taste different, you'll be scared. Woo! But uh, that concludes my review. My spooky spot on. On Crush Ghoulish Grape. Hope you guys enjoyed it. And uh, with that, I'll see you guys next time. Ooh!